Hello friends, welcome back to Multi Question World. Today we are going to discuss important questions for various laboratory technologies exams. If you are watching without subscribing, please do subscribe. Question number 1. A quantitative serum HCG is ordered on a male patient. The technologist should Option A. Perform the test and report the result. Option B. Request that the order to be cancelled. Option C. Perform and report the result if negative. Option D. Perform and report the result only if greater than 25 IU per liter. The right answer is option A. Perform the test and report the result because quantitative HCG is ordered on a male patient in suspected cases of tumors. Question number 2. Non-diabetic ketonuria can occur in all of the following except Option A. Pregnancy Option B. Renal failure Option C. Starvation Option D. Lactate acidosis The right answer is option B. Renal failure Non-diabetic ketonuria can be occur in pregnancy, starvation and in lactate acidosis Next question, thyroid hormones are derived from which of the following amino acid? The options, option A, phenylalanine, option B, methionine, option C, tyrosine, option D, histidine. The right answer is option C, tyrosine. Thyroid hormones are derived from the amino acid tyrosine. Next question, which assay is used to confirm difficult cases of hypothyroidism? Option A, free T4 assay. Option B, free thyroxine index. Option C, thyrotropin releasing hormone that is TRH stimulation test. Option D, TBG assay. The right answer is option C, thyrotropin releasing hormone stimulation test is used to confirm difficult cases of hypothyroidism. Fifth question, which of the following is the preferable site for bone marrow aspiration and biopsy in an adult. Option A. Iliac crust. Option B. Sternum. Option C. Tibia. Option D. Spinous process of a vertebra. Which of the following site is preferable? That is Iliac crust. The right answer is option A. Iliac crust. Question number 6. Mean cell volume or MCV is calculated using the following formula. Option A. Hemoglobin divided by RBC into 10. Option B. HCV divided by RBC into 10. Option C. HCT divided by HB into 100. Option B. HB divided by RBC into 100. The right answer is option B. HCT divided by RBC into 10. Question number 7. Variation in red cell size observed on the peripheral smear is described as Option A. Anisocytosis Option B. Hypochromia Option C. Poikilocytosis Option D. Pleocytosis The right answer is Option A. Anisocytosis Variation in red cell size is known as anisocytosis. Question number 8. Insufficient centrifugation will result in Option A. False increase in hematocrit value Option B. A false decrease in hematocrit value Option C. No effect on HCT value Option D. All of these options The right answer is Option A. False increase in hematocrit value If the centrifugation is insufficient, it will not be packed the cells correctly so it will result in false increase in PCV. Question number 9. A Miller disc is an ocular device used to facilitate counting of option A platelets, option B reticulocytes, option C sickle cells, option D NRBC. Miller disc is used for which of the following count? The right answer is option B reticulocytes. That means for reticulocyte counting, 
the microscopic field has to be minimized with a miller disc question number 10 a decreased osmotic fragility test would be associated with which of the following conditions decreased osmotic fragility test is associated with which of the following conditions option a sickle cell anemia hereditary spherocytosis option c hemolytic disease of newborn option d acute hemolytic anemia the right answer is option a sickle cell anemia in sickle cell anemia there is a decreased osmotic fragility Question number 12. All of the following factors may influence the ESR except Option A. Blood drawn into a sodium citrate tube Option B. Anisocytosis and poikilocytosis Option C. Plasma proteins Option D. Calibration of the tube The question is which of the following factors may not influence ESR value? The right answer is Option A. Blood drawn into a sodium citrate tube For ESR estimation Blood has to be drawn into a sodium citrate tube, so it will not affect ESR value. Question number 12. Which of the following is the best analyte to monitor for recurrence of ovarian cancer? That means, which of the following is marker for ovarian cancer? Option A, CA 15.3. Option B, CA 19.9. Option C, CA 125. Option D, CEA. The right answer is option C. CA 125 is... The marker for ovarian cancer. Question number 13. The media of choice for recovery of Vibrio cholerae. Option A. Macaulay agar and thioglycolate media. Option B. TCBS agar and alkaline peptide water broth. Option C. Blood agar and selenate F broth. Option D. CND agar. Which of the following media is choice for Vibrio cholerae? The right answer is option B, TCBS and alkaline peptide water broth. Question number 14. At which pH does methane red test become positive? Option A, 7. Option B, 6.5. Option C, 6. Option D, 4.5. At which pH does methane red test become positive? The right answer is option D, 4.5. Methyl red test is production of acid, so the pH will be 4.5. Question number 50. In addition to staph aureus, which will also produce coagulis? Option A, staph intermediates. Option B, staph saprophyticus. Option C, staph hominis. Option D, all of these options. Which of the following will produce coagulis? In addition to staph aureus, the right answer is option A, staphylococcus intermediates. Today we are winding up. You can watch the previous videos from playlist. And if you are watching without subscribing, please do subscribe the channel. Thank you.